open to the public. Welcome aboard the UEES Warhammer. As part of this year's Invictus celebrations, I'd like to invite you to take a look around and get an up-close look at an active military vessel. Some of the actual crew members have graciously volunteered their time to explain what life is like aboard the ship. I would like to remind you that the entire ship is not available for exploration, so please be respectful of unauthorized areas. Thank you, and enjoy your visit. <coughs> Hello everyone, my name's Lieutenant Horrigan, and as you can probably tell, this is Warhammer's Mess Hall. Definitely one of the more popular spaces on the ship. The mess has a fully automated dispensary since we operate on rotating shifts. We have a standard crew complement of 65 to 70, and meals need to be available at all times, so we have a culinary team always on duty, ready to lend support. Famous pilot Ari O'Reilly was once quoted as saying, if you ever want to take the temperature of a ship's crew, spend 20 minutes in their mess. Now this is one of the main social areas of the ships where crew members from different departments can catch up in their own downtime. We also use the mess for social events like uh, birthdays, holidays, and promotions, since it's able to hold so many people. Our skipper, Captain Medcalf, is a big believer in in casual gatherings. It's in an effort to entrench camaraderie. So we're in here pretty often. Now, you've probably noticed our games in the corner, so I'll just address the question that everyone asks. Yes, it's pretty competitive. <coughs> the XO currently has the score to beat. Anyway, I'd like to invite you to have a look around. Sound it better in the brochure. Mm. 
Hi, folks. Welcome to the Warhammer. I am leading Starman Detmer, and this, as you've probably guessed, is one of the two barracks on the ship. And I know, I know, you must be thrilled to see where I made it. Enough bunk for the full crew, which is amazing because it avoids situations known as hot bunking, where you swap out bunks with somebody on the opposite shore. Smelling socks, um, and I'm talking, you know, the military could have weaponized it. Javelin-class destroyer was originally built by Aegis Dynamics and has been in active service since 2832. Launching under the command of Captain Omar Singh, the ship initially served as a combat years. support vessel in the Second Fleet, Sixth Battle Group, <clears throat> a posting that put it close to the Van Duel front. The Warhammer saw action during the fall of Caliban in 2884, where it protected retreating civilian and naval forces when the system ultimately fell earning a ribbon for power in the process. For the next several decades, the Warhammer transitioned between fleets in a variety of support and patrol positions, BCs. even participating in the UEE push to reclaim the Nexus system in the 2930s. <coughs> Most recently, the Warhammer distinguished itself what as the primary doing? combat vessel to repel the outlaw group known as Xenothreat from the Stanton system. Since then, the Warhammer has been placed in dry dock for repairs, oh God. but is heading back to active service once this year's Invictus is concluded. I'm lost. No. Okay. Need glasses? Class destroyer was originally built by Aegis Dynamics and has been in service since 2832. What? Launching under the command of Captain Omar Singh, the ship initially served as a combat support.
just been in here. I'm just been, I'm just been in here. Hello, okay. welcome to the UEES Warhammer. This Javelin class destroyer was originally built by Aegis Dynamics. in a circle, aren't I? Hello everyone, my name's Lieutenant Horrigan, and as you can probably tell, this is Warhammer's Mess Hall. Definitely one go. of the more popular. Right. So, this way. Welcome aboard the UEES yeah, Warhammer. As part of this year's Invictus. Around out there, we go. Thank you, sir. What life is like aboard the ship. I would like to remind you that the entire ship is not a Another bunk. And another red door. With a lot of NPCs trying to get through it. This is fucking hilarious. Look at the state of this. See, so this is actually a corridor and they just stuck this here to stop you from going any further. Standing around scratching your head. Stop, don't cough on me. No, 
a sound. Aegis combat assist activated. Systems green. This is thing fire. Reset sensitivity. Power off. Exit. Oh, I see. It just don't make a lot of noise. I'm sure they used to be louder. Yeah. 